photo by Harry Howe, Getty Images, Los Angeles Dodgers Jock Pedersen The Los Angeles Dodgers have a lot of power on the roster but also have too much of a good thing, left-handed hitting. While the team does have Justin Turner and left-handed hitter Corey Seager, who is not bad against southpaws, the Dodgers still are much worse off when they are facing left-handed pitching. Manager Dave Roberts echoed these sentiments, stating that the team does indeed need one more impactful right-handed bat, HTLA Times, that has led to an interest in free agent outfielder AJ. Pollock, who is a former All-Star and is right-handed. Well Pollock doesn't seem to be the solution, since he hit under .230 last season against Southpaws and hasn't played a full season since 2015, he does seem to be the team's top priority. To open space for Pollock in the outfield, and likely to ensure that top prospect Alex Verdugo gets to start, the Los Angeles Dodgers are reportedly shopping Jock Peterson. Pollock is contingent on ultimately trading outfielder Jock Peterson trade could come either before or after signing of Pollock. Peterson is currently being shopped to multiple teams, Michael J. Duarte, at Michael Duarte, January 23, 2019 Although Peterson is a fan favorite, this makes sense. He is coming off his best year since the first half of his rookie season. His trade value is as high as it is ever going to be and there still is that chance that he resorts back to his heavy strikeout ways. While he does add a left-handed power surge to the order, the team already has that in Cody Bellinger and Max Muncy. To want to flip that for a right-handed bat is understandable. There should be multiple suitors lined up for Peterson with a few teams, in particular, that would be the perfect fit for the power-hitting outfielder. Here are the three best fits for Peterson outside of LA along with the expendable trade pieces they could potentially send. Next, Dire Need of Outfielders page to use your arrows to browse photo by Gregory Seamus Getty Images Los Angeles Dodgers The Cleveland Indians should be picking up the phone and calling Andrew Friedman and the Los Angeles Dodgers front office constantly to try and work out a deal for Jock Peterson. The Indians are in dire need of outfielders if the team wants to contend in 2019 and is looking to add cheap options, which Peterson is. The Dodgers and Indians have been linked since the beginning of the offseason because of the Dodgers' surplus of outfielders and the possible trade pieces the Indians could send in return. A deal was never worked out and speculation faded, however, it could easily be reignited with Peterson on the table. Peterson would be a great middle-of-the-order bet that the Indians could bat 5th or even 4th and would directly benefit from having Jose Ramirez and Francisco Lindor hitting ahead of him. His RBI numbers would undoubtedly soar and he would excel in the hitter-friendly progressive field. The obvious return that the Dodgers would want would be Corey Kluber, who would undoubtedly give the Dodgers the best starting rotation in baseball. It would take more than Peterson to get Kluber but Peterson is a good place to start. He is young, controllable and can make an impact now. Peterson, top pitching prospect Dustin May, catching prospect Will Smith and a young big league arm, such as Caleb Ferguson or Dennis Santana, would be a fair price to pay for Kluber. If not Kluber, the Dodgers could explore the rest of the starting rotation or flip Peterson for prospects. Use your arrows to browse.